Okay, so he has things to do, but he's making a special appearance from my boyfriend has my makeup video. What color? Oh yeah, quick interview. Oh, what color would you be your favorite if you had to choose? It would be this one. Out of all of them? Yes. Red. Sample sale. This is the guy's favorite. So if your man wants to be pleased by nail polish. Red is classy. This. Just buy red nail polish. Guys like it. Hey everyone, I'm back with another Sephora haul. You guys are gonna hate me for my Sephora hauls constantly, but I'm obsessed with um, shopping for makeup. And a quick disclaimer, I'm basically the only one in my family who likes um, accessories and jewelry and makeup and goes shopping for it. Just a little example, my mom wore Nikes on her wedding day. She rarely wears makeup <laughs> and she's kind of like a tomboy. It's cool though, but she'll wear like glittery Nikes you know, girl it up a little bit. So before there are any comments like, why do you always post so many hauls? It's because I work for my own money and I spend it on what I love and I save as well. I should probably save more, but um, I love makeup. So this is all what I love and I hope you guys enjoy it. So I just got back from the Sephora friends and family haul. If you guys don't know what happened, or what happened, what it is, it's a 20% off sale. Um, if you're a VIB, you get 20% off for you and a friend, and it's actually going on until the 14th. I went today though because they gave a bag and chocolate coffee stuff. I don't even know. I describe this as heaven in a box, okay? This is 36, 18, if I'm doing my math right. Sephora by OPI Mini Nail Polishes. Okay, I already put this one on my nails. I love it. And this color is this one, which is Dear Diary. It's actually switched around, but yeah. I don't know. Let me know which one is your favorite color because I really can't choose. I'm obsessed with these. Maybe I'll give one away as a giveaway. What do you guys think? And I know this is pricey. But this is how my mind figured it out when I was like trying to buy it and I was thinking of the pros and the cons. Yeah, I do that. I never go through a full bottle of polish or very rarely. So this is 18 for 48 when one bottle at Sephora is I'm pretty sure 950. So I can get four large ones which I'll never go through or 18 of these beautiful babies. So I got this. Ah! I love it. Mwah. This is really boring to me. They had me come like the first day of the sale just to get a tote bag, which I'm sorry, I don't care about tote bags. It's just, you know, I I mean, it's good to reuse, but I have about 50 tote bags that companies give. So it kind of defeats the purpose because they're giving tote bags to reuse and recycle, but then they give them away for free and they give so many and I don't even know. I'm sorry, but I see two bags here. So they gave me this one in this bag. That doesn't make sense if they're trying to go green and all that stuff. Sorry, that was my little rant. This is the most amazing mascara. You guys know I'm obsessed with Maybelline Falsies. And, you know, I get really pissed at myself when I become in love with a high-end mascara or foundation or something like that. Because then when I want to repurchase it, it's like 50 times more the price. Or 50 times more expensive. <laughs> So this was at the end when you check out and you get really like grabbed into buying more. Ugh, Sephora does that. So this was $14 for two, uh, I guess, minis or medium-sized Urban Decay 24-7 eyeliners. And those are my favorite eyeliners. I've already opened basically everything I'm showing you guys because I'm like a little girl. I just have to open everything when I buy it. That's why this boxing looks so crappy. But I like this a lot. Then I purchased a new product. I've been looking at the Fresh line for so long and I just haven't purchased anything. So I found this, which is a lip scrub and the chaps or lip balm for $22.50. And it smells really good. It's so um, moisturizing and the, let me see. The lip polish I tried today, it was kind of interesting to put on. I don't know. The lip treatment though is SPF 15, so I'm always going to put that on.
before I go out or in the sun or anything. So yeah, I made this look like new, although this has been in my purse all day. So, ha <laughs> NARS! Every single time I go in Sephora, I try on the NARS lipsticks, and I was so stuck between two. I ended up with Roman Holiday. It's just like a Barbie pink color and matte. And I love it so much. I actually have a similar one, though, I realized, by Revlon. I think it's called Pink Pout. But um, this one is just so nice. And look at that packaging. Okay, watch. It's like a snap. Ah, I love that sound. Am I crazy? I think I'm crazy. So since I got Roman Holiday, it's a little bit too bright. Or it's not too bright, but I'm not always in the mood. If I'm going to school, I'm not in the mood to look like fresh freshly done up Barbie or something like that. So I got this lip gloss which had amazing, amazing reviews. I was actually going to get the lip gloss Angelica by NARS, but I ended up with Turkish Delight. And it's just, sorry I had an itch on my nose. It's just a light pink. It's so pretty. And it's, it's just such a pretty color. It actually kind of matches my nail polish. Oh, and Kim Kardashian wears this, so it must be good. Just kidding. So for my 100 point perks, usually I don't find anything that I really like, but for some reason right now they have like the best 100 point perks ever. So the first one is the Laura Mercier. Just kidding. So the first one is the Laura Mercier Tinted Moisturizer SPF 20 Illuminating. And that's pretty good because these are so expensive to me. And I'm happy to try this. I love, love the Silk Cream Foundation now, by the way. So I'm really happy I got this for my 100 points. And then the one I am the happiest about. Every single time I go in Sephora, I look at the Urban Decay... Hold on. <laughs> 24... No. After Glow Glide On Cheek Tint. And I always look at it, but I never sample it because the sample always looks gross in there. But they have it in the 100 point perk. And it's in the shade Quickie. And just look how pretty it is. It's a cream blush. I'm in love with it. I use this. And then um, to set it sometimes, I put my e.l.f. blush. I'm not sure the shade right now. But it's that really, really bright pink one. You guys would know what it is if you go look on the website. So I'm so happy about this. I know I shouldn't get excited over just samples, but basically I ordered some of this stuff online. I lied. It's not all from the sample sale, but I got 20% online too. But um, besides the fact, you know how you get three free samples? So I chose the Givenchy Photo Perfection. I chose the Soy Fresh face exfoliant and then I chose Kate Walsh boyfriend which is like one of my favorite perfumes but I have a love-hate relationship with it sometimes it's too strong it makes me kind of nauseous sometimes I absolutely love it but I've never bought the full bottle because of the fact of that it was under the free samples I was like sweet well I got my package and the boyfriend wasn't in there and they replaced it with like some perfume that I didn't want so it's like that sucks oh no they replaced it with the caramel eyebrow gel and it's a little too dark for me so I was like that really sucks so while I was at Sephora at the actual store there was such a long line and they were trying to please the customers and they were really sweet they were giving out chocolates and then they were giving out samples so I got this and I went up to the employee and I said by any chance do you have the sample boyfriend by Kate Walsh and she had a bag full of these and she's like no I'm sorry I don't she's like I'll just look but I really doubt it there was one Kate Walsh boyfriend perfume in there out of all the perfumes in the world it was there it was like fate since I didn't get it on my online order I got it there I don't even know where it is right now <laughs> oh here it is guys girls boyfriend so that was the end of my haul I really hope Everyone enjoyed it. If you went to the friends and family sale, um, show me what you got. Tell me what you got. You can still go this weekend until the 14th. So make sure to go stock up. And I love makeup. And I love Sephora. And I love you guys. That was cheesy. But um, yeah. All right. Mwah.